All right, while we wait for more students to join us, I uh, just want to uh, thank all the uh, students who showed up and participated in to today's uh, activities. Uh, this morning, uh, thank you to all the homeroom teachers who were able to um, proceed with the house color selections. I hope all of you guys got into uh, good colors, good teams, or enjoy uh, with the members of your colors. It was it was good this morning to see uh, our candidates uh, run some activities with you, hopefully showed you their organizational skills, their creativity, and how their team uh, would be able to uh, lead you. And then in the late morning, uh, a lot of you guys uh, were able to vote. Right now we're at about 120 viewers. We'll wait till we get to uh, closer to 200 and then we'll talk about what everybody here is uh, waiting to see. Um, I wanna make sure that uh, everybody knows that for the student council election, um, Crew Bo, Crew Ann uh, have been working really hard in in organizing uh, the election, making sure that the homeroom meets have been going well for you students, uh, getting their assistance in helping disseminate the candidates' uh, information and their and their Instagram posts. Uh, many thanks to Crew JJ for uh, creating our our online election system. We're at about 130 viewers now. We'll, we'll keep wait, waiting. We'll get, once we get to about closer to 200, hopefully we can hit that mark. We only have four likes now. I wonder how many dislikes we have. <laughs> uh, I hope you guys had fun in the afternoon. The uh, the activities that the the homeroom teachers created for you to, to gather house points. Um, hopefully this will be the first of many um, house color activities that allow your house color to collect points that will accumulate over the year and culminate in um, a, a sports colors day. Um, if not, we will do our best to make sure that you get as, just as much fun, camaraderie, excitement, and involvement from our traditional sports colors activities um, that we normally do at school with new and improved um, maybe online activities that can get you guys up and moving and getting together. It was fun to see you guys and you're already dressed in some of your house colors. Um, and some of you were very creative in, in wearing um, clothes in those colors this afternoon. Hopefully we'll see some of those pictures later. We're close to about 150 viewers now. I hope everybody can see the my, my screen there. Um, that we're, we're going to announce the election results quite soon. It's good. Then we're we're up to about 160 viewers, 18 likes. Let's see if I if I can get 50 likes, maybe I'll start announcing the results. How about that? Is that is that a good target to hit? No, no, now we have 20 likes. Oh, 25. It sounds like you guys want to listen to the results. Hundred and sixty-three viewers now. All right. Um, so Hopefully, we'll be able to tally the results uh, for the afternoon elect uh, for the afternoon house color activities for you um, as soon as possible. We'll have uh, the school's uh, media channels, um, our Instagram, our Facebook, uh, post those results up for you, and then we'll keep a, a running tally um, throughout the year for all the house color activities. Um, Please remember to uh, subscribe to our, our YouTube channel here. Uh, uh, we're gonna try to put up more uh, videos uh, since we're all online now. 
Um, we're going to try to keep you guys up to date a little more, filming a little more, um, some of the activities that, that we get going. Uh, on on another note, I want to uh, uh, announce that the uh, Bunyarat High School debate team will be starting up practices again. Um, I'll, I'll send out a formal email uh, invite, and then you guys can start joining us for practices. Um, it'll be after school from about 3 to 5. We're looking to have a couple uh, online competitions, internal and, and go external, in the upcoming year. So this might be a good chance for you if you've never joined debate or tried debate or, or, or just wanted to learn some public speaking techniques, this will be a good chance for you. Okay. All right, I've got, I've got 167 viewers, uh, only 49 likes. All right, it's 52 likes now. We've been hovering around 160 so viewers. Not sure how many more we're going to get. Um, so I'll, I'll go ahead and recap today's uh, events and then just start with the election uh, results. Okay, um, so this morning everybody got to select their House colors. All right. Thank you very much for for showing up, uh, being on time, and the home teachers for organizing that. I want to say thank you again to uh, our candidates for putting their hat in the ring. Um, it's very brave, nerve wracking, courageous for people to 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 test themselves out. Um, to open themselves up to uh, being judged on their ideas and their abilities. All right. I want to thank uh, Crew Bo, Crew Ann, and Crew JJ for helping out with the election process, uh, working uh, not only on the online vote, but on the on the organization of the uh, speaking with the candidates, of uh, helping to talk our candidates through all their all their activities, and then thank you to all the homeroom teachers in the afternoon for organizing the house colors activities. I know the kids uh, really enjoyed it, and we'll announce those results as soon as we can. Let's start with the election results. All right. So let's look at the summary of votes. Total, total um, enrolled students are 299. Total votes we got were 279 students, right? And so uh, we got about 17 no votes. So the votes for the candidates were about 262 votes. Okay, and the winner is, we'll, we'll go ahead and go from uh, the, the third, second, and the first. Mm -hmm. I know I know if Group Boy was here with me, he'd, he'd have a soundtrack for you guys to listen to. I'm, I'm at home with my uh, iMac, so you guys just get to see the, uh, the slideshow here. All right, so without any further ado, hope you guys are ready. In third place, there were 36 votes. In second place, there are 94 votes. And in first place, they received 132 votes. All right, you guys ready? Yeah? Okay, here we go. Third place. Let's congratulate Peach. In second place, with 94 votes. So it means the other person will be our student council president for Bunyar High School in 2021 is second place, 
Cheng, which means that with 132 votes, Thames is our next student council president for the year 2021. Congratulate to all three candidates on a wonderful campaign. I was glad that there was a campaign run with ideas. It was one with camaraderie. It was run on the best of circumstances. And they did this all online, promoting themselves to you guys. So congratulations to Thames. Uh, we will slowly work with her community, working on her platform and the other students who were elected to represent their grade levels uh, and work with the school in making it a better place for all the students. All right. Congratulations. Thank you very much for tuning in. Um, we'll try to keep you guys updated on school activities as much as possible in our times of distance. Uh, please stay home, stay safe. Remember to wash your hands when you go out, right? Remember to use hand gel. Uh, you never know who's going to have uh, COVID or be in contact with somebody who does until the entire country gets vaccinated and, and we can be safe again. Um, please stay at home. We'll let you know the point results from uh, the the house color activity games via the school media channels, whether Instagram, Facebook, or YouTube, please go ahead and subscribe to all of them so that you can stay in touch and be notified when that happens. All right. Thank you very much. I look forward to seeing you guys soon. Take care of yourselves and be safe.